All right, everybody, welcome to it. This is your 12U A1 Bulls taking on the Columbus Cottonmouths with some friendlies today. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Hey, Vicky Liggett, see you on there. So this is just a friendly, uh, a friendly matchup, like an exhibition type game. Bulls wearing their black jerseys. Columbus will be in their white. We're on the main rink side. I love it. I know Lauren Cole loves it. She's only wearing one of her heated jackets. So. It's not even, oh, it's on. It's on. So we'll have Big Macon Reed in net this game. Okay. We'll go ahead and also take this opportunity to thank our coaches. Again, these are volunteers. We appreciate everything y'all do for these young men. Got John Del Bosco with me here. John, how's it going? Uh, am I on mute? You're muted, sir. As always, I'm muted. Hang on. How about now? Yep, got you now. There okay, we are. There we go. All right. Justin doesn't want me to talk. I'm going to be a silent participant today. Not at all. You are the voice no. of the 12U Bulls program. No. John's the talent. That's why I pay him so well. The pressure. I, I may get fired at any moment. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a hot minute since we've seen Columbus. Woo. It has. Their season is done in league play. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. So I've got some of the Reese fan club here right below us. Uh-oh. I was told that potentially a church group was going to listen in to the game today. Oh. No, oh, well, then I, they definitely can't swear, so. No. No. <laughs> That was Brad that told me this. All right, that's. So Bulls coming off a great weekend last weekend. We went three and one, dropped one to the Mad Hatters in that last game, but uh, really strong show and the kids look good. Other than that last game, but they also got punched a lot, so <laughs> you know. We'll see how this one goes. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully the rest will keep it under control. That's right. <laughs> All right, there's the buzzer. End of our three-minute warm-up. Not sure what. Well, I guess we're going to run 13-minute periods. We may just kind of fudge that last one. So for now, we're running 13-minute periods. But I believe the last time we played a friendly, instead of a 13-minute third period, it wound up being 18 minutes or something like that. <laughs> well, we got our mathematicians in the... <laughs> In the scoreboard area over there, we got Tobin and I think it's Brad, and they, they like to do the math going into the third. Get every last bit of that hour of ice time we paid for, right? That's right. All right, so boys getting a quick word from Coach Jeffries down there. We'll be underway here. We got refs, we got players, we got goals. And uh, assuming we have a puck. I think the refs got some. Yeah, I hope so. All right, we're going to start off with a hairy lineup with Reese playing left wing, Finney playing right. Easton and Gavin will be the defensive pairing. And Columbus wins the faceoff back. Finnegan goes and chases, gets there first, though. Finney's looking for that pass. No, gets boarded over there. But Harry there to help out. Get the puck up. Finney's trying to retrieve his stick. He does. 
However, Columbus gets it, sends it right up, and Columbus is out. Columbus dumps it in. There's a little bit of a chase. Columbus gets there first. Ooh. Falls down behind the net. Columbus recovers, though. Has the puck. Looking for that pass in the slot. They take a shot. Blocked away. Good save there by Megan. Gavin sends it along the boards. Far side for Harry. Harry sends it up for Reese. Reese sneaks it past the defensive player. Now he's Reese looking up for a pass over to Finney. Oh, just missed that one-timer. Great idea between Reese and Finney. Otherwise, that would have been a goal. Finney would have got that one. Well, here we go. Back here, we got... Looks like Nixie going to take a shot. Good cover up by Megan. So we got to be aware of that. Columbus is good at changing the side of the ice real quick. Especially number, uh, what is it, 11 with Nixie. Was, yeah, Nixie. And so we got to be on our toes. They're a fast team. That's what they use. Oh, looks like uh, defense pairing for Columbus allows the puck to get out of the own ice. Gus takes a shot right up and boxes. Oh, Taylor with the rebound opportunity. But it was covered up by Columbus's goalie. Good work by Gus. Getting around the defense, setting up a, it looked like a potential harmless shot. Put it slowly on net and Taylor, though, had an opportunity. Here's Brady with a shot, bad angle. Stick to side. Taylor trying to keep it in. Backhands it in. It goes right back to Taylor. Taylor looking for a pass over to Gus. No, gets intercepted. Brady! Brady just misses the net. It was wide open. It was there. Good work by this line. Brady's line. Good work by Taylor. Get it back to Remy. Remy, uh oh. Unable to keep it in. Going straight to the net. And Megan's just going to cover that one up. Good work by Megan. As Columbus was bearing down there. But man, that Brady line with Taylor and, and Gus putting a few go good scoring chances there. Hey, Vicky Liggett. Hey, Susan Stevenson. All right. Appreciate so y'all watching. We got Jack's line out there with Will and Ling Jay. Jack wins it over to Ling Jay's side. Ling Jay tries to roll out. Uh, gets tied up along the boards, but Jack gets the puck back. Sends it along over to Gavin. Gavin tries to backhand it out. Nope. As uh, Columbus able to keep it in. But Ling Jay sends it right back out. Goes right back to Columbus's defense. They try to send it up to Nixie. Good step up by Ling Jay. Ling Jay's got Will, but he doesn't have numbers, so he's going to circle. Good work by Will, delaying, sending the pass over. Columbus gets there first, gets it out, and we're off to the races. Should be and an icing. Should be an icing. Yep. And it is. Yep. All right. Good work by Ling Jay on that last shift, stepping up. Making some plays, dictating the the neutral zone there. So we're going back to uh, Harry's line here. Finney, Reese, Remy, and Ethan. Let's see what, if Harry can win this face off cleanly. Uh, Columbus wins it over to the Finnegan side. Gets pushed ahead in front, out of Ethan's zone. And now we're in the middle. Good step up there by Remy. Not allowing that fast break. Still along the near side boards. Looks like Harry was able to enter the zone safely. Harry turning around. Gets around one player. Sends it in front. Finney taps it over to Reese. Oh, just away from Reese's stick. Now here again. Got to be aware. Columbus likes to go fast. And they do. As always. Look, try to put it one on net. Good defensive play by Remy. Not allowing a shot on net there. <clears throat> but Columbus still has the puck. They send it back to the blue line. They step up. Get it. The puck. Deep in Bull's end. Here's Ethan. Ethan sends it up the boards for Finney. They do get it out of the zone. Columbus checks up. Sends it right back in. Ethan has it. Looking for a pass. He backhands it to Finney. Finney chips it in front. Finney's trying to get through. He does. Uh, met with some pressure there. Loses puck possession. But Harry's wide open for a shot. Oh, goes wide. Big rebound. Reese couldn't find it. It was bouncing. But there was an open side of the net there. Puck gets set back to Remy. Remy's going to send it back in. Reese trying to keep it in. Columbus gets it, though. Yeah, good back check by Harry, but no. Columbus gets it out. Quickly go into the bowl zone. They stop. They circle. Look for a backhand pass. They get it in front of the net. Good work but between Remy and uh, Ethan there. Get the puck away. 
So here they come. Dylan with the shot. Gloved by Megan. So Columbus has control of the puck recently. But Macon snared that one right out of the air. We gotta be careful here. Good win by Brady. Win it back to Gavin. Gavin circling the net, gets pressured, so he sends a pass over to Taylor. Taylor accepts the pass, sends it right to Brady. Just couldn't accept the pass, and here comes Columbus right back in. Columbus coming in. Good work by back checking there by Brady to help the defense out. We get the puck away, and it's offsides. So with 8.44 left in the first, a little back and forth. A couple solid chances for the Bulls. Just couldn't put one away. Brady, faceoff comes near side. Columbus sends it in, doesn't go deep enough. Gavin gets it first, sends it cross ice pass. Great pass to Taylor. Taylor dumps it in for a chase. Here goes Gus and Taylor. Columbus gets there first, coming near side. They send it along the boards. They do get it out. Brady challenges right at the line. Comes right back to Gavin. Nope. Columbus gets it, kicks it. Still working their way in, taking a shot, going wide. Easton sends it along the boards there for Taylor. Taylor tries to backhand it out. He does, and that should be an offside. As Columbus just threw it back in. All right, so we got Jack out there. He's going to be the one taking the face off. Will's the near side. Ling J just skated over to the far side. Got Remy and Ethan playing D, and good work by Jack pushing it forward. Ling J. Columbus able to exit the zone, though, real quick. Uses the boards, pass it up. They got a little room. They're going to go ahead and take a shot. Goes wide. Good hard shot, but it went wide. Along the near side boards, puck comes out for Ling Jay. Ling Jay goes and gets it. Oh, gets sticked away. Gets a good poke check by Columbus. Ling Jay was building up speed. Columbus has it, looking for the cross ice pass. They do, D to D. They send it up. Columbus looking for that centering pass. Ling J jumped over his stick. Still in the bull's end. Remy stepping up, getting it up to Ling J. We got a two on two. Ling J working his way in. He gets through. Good work by Ling J. Oh, just missed the puck at the end there. Will trying to help out. So does Jack. Puck no comes out. So Bull's got to check back up. And puck comes all the way in. And Bulls covered up, making. Hey, John. Angelo says hey. Oh, well, hello, Dad. How's it <laughs> going? You're actually watching. All right. Easton's out there, by the way, Dad. He's out there along with uh, Gavin. Puck comes back for Gavin, his defensive partner, who sends it along for Reese. Reese has the puck along the boards. Tries to make that pass, intercepted by Nixie. But good work between Harry and Gavin to give it away. And good pass by Gavin. Get up to Finney. Who gets it over to Reese? Reese slides up. Oh, just didn't get enough on it. Finney sends it over. Oh, hits the post as Harry was wide open in the slot. Here we go. So Columbus working their way in the neutral zone. Sends it far. Still in the neutral zone. Bulls stepping up, not allowing them to get in easy. Good work by the Bulls, separating the puck away from Nixie. Get it right back up to Reese. Reese has numbers. He's going to go and take a long shot. Oh! Did it go in? Went in? It went in. That went in. Wow. We'll take it. Hey, nothing hurts to just shoot one right on net. That's right. And Reese scores the first goal of the game. I, I believe, John, it was the poet of our generation one Sir Lil John that said shots, shots, shots. Something <laughs> like that. Something like that. So shoot the puck. Here we go. Oh, Taylor almost. Man. Oh, they're going to call him offsides too on that. He lost puck control going across the, the blue line. And he actually <laughs> crossed the line before the puck and came offside. Brady's calling him back in. Brady's going to try to win this puck again. Actually, it goes back to Ethan. Ethan's going to send it cross ice to Taylor. Taylor's going to backhand it, trying to get it in. No, poke checked away by Columbus. Oh, good work by Remy stepping up. 
puck comes right to Brady. Brady's going to take a shot. Goes high and wide. Brady had a lot of power on that one. Here goes Gus. Good pass over to Brady. Brady trying to get in front. There's a rebound. Unable to find it was Gus. Gus was and Taylor looking for that puck. But good work by Columbus goalie. Wrapping that one up. So we got 550 left in the first. Again, bowls up. one nothing. We're going to keep Brady in. Brady's doing a solid job winning these faceoffs. Let's see if we can get it over to Ethan as our D's is prepared and waiting. Oh, nope. Columbus wins that one. And here he comes. Nixie looks for that outlet pass. He does. They got a whole head of steam. Remy trying to help out. Good block save there by Megan. He, I think he used his head on that one. Columbus isn't done, though. We got to be ready. Columbus sends a pass right point blank. Nixie trying to backhand that one in. Thank goodness he missed the net. Columbus circling. They still have the puck. They send another backhand in front. Nixie's looking for a wraparound. He passes it in front. Good work by Talon. Sending it up to Brady. Breaking that one up. Brady's got a whole head of steam. Brady's going to take a long shot. Oh, he just misses it. Great idea. It's goalie. Unable to find that puck recently. Brady trying to win it back. Columbus gets it, though. They send it up. Gavin tries to step up. He does. Good work by Gavin taking it. Gavin trying to keep it in. Still in for the time being. Now it comes out. Near side. If you can't see, Gavin's got the puck. Gavin tries to backhand it out. He does. He goes over to Taylor. Taylor sees open ice. Sends it cross ice for Brady. Brady coming in. Good work by Brady. Using his body and size. He's looking for a wraparound. Trying to pass it in front. Nobody home. Gus on the other side. is going to try to pass it in front. Gets blocked aside, but comes right back to it. Uh, I'm sorry. That's Will. My apologies. That is Will trying to pass it in front. He doesn't. Puck comes back into the neutral zone. East and sends it back onto the Columbus side. Puck comes right back. East is going to take that and go right with it. Here comes Easton. East is going to wind up. No, he takes a pass over to, I think that's Will. Will just couldn't get it on his stick. So Will finds it, though. Sends it back deep. Columbus gets there first. Good work by Jack. Getting away. Oh, what a sneaky pass by Jack. Nobody home. Ling Jay was trying to get there. Good back check by Jack. Keeps it in the Columbus zone. Columbus making them work deep from their own end. Jack sends another puck in front. Nobody home. Columbus gets it. Sends it along the boards. Near side. Gavin's trying to step up. No, Columbus gets around him. We got to be careful here. As Columbus got speed. They have speed. And good work by Easton lifting the stick. Allowing Megan to make the save. So with 338 left in the first. Good hustle there by the Bulls. Just couldn't quite connect on another goal. <clears throat> got to be careful here. We got Nixie out there with Harry. Harry's face off. Goes over to the Columbus. Columbus sends a shot. Uh-oh. Wow. We got to be ready here. Puck's right in front. Wow. Harry realizing we're under a whole lot of pressure there. Sends it across the ice for icing. But we'll take it. There was a prime, yeah, there was a prime scoring opportunity as uh, Columbus took a shot from the blue line. Nixie tipped it, uh, making able to make that first save. All right, same lineup for both teams. Faceoff goes right in front of our net. Remy sends it right back out. Oh, a shot goes right off Ethan. Oh, he, Nixie makes a sneaky shot, but making up for the save. Weird bounce off the boards allows Columbus to keep it in. Columbus is going to take another shot blocked away by Macon. Macon. Now Columbus feeling it, trying to work. No, Bull's able to get it out. Good work by Harry. Harry finds Finney. Just over his stick. Finney's trying to work it. He does. He gets by one. He's looking for that pass. Oh, Columbus all over that. Covered it up. Good work by their goalie. Finney, Finney's pass was just a little too close to the goalie. So 2.52 left in the first. Face off coming to the near side here. Bull's going to keep their same lineup out there, and it looks like they're going to do the same for Columbus. Nixie wins the face off back for Columbus. Columbus backhands it along the boards. Ethan trying to keep it in, takes a weird hop, and now Columbus off to the races. Remy, oh no, oh, Remy's little bump just caused Columbus just to get off the puck just a little bit. They're still behind the net, causing damage. Right now, Harry able to separate it. And Reese tries to make that one-hand pass over to Finney. Finney, no. Uh, yeah, it was, yeah, it was icing. 
I didn't see somebody's hand up. Neither the refs. <laughs> right idea. Yeah. And they were they were probably a half step away from Finney being back there by himself, but just a big two big touch there. All right, so we're changing up our offense pairing. Brady takes a face off that goes wide of Macon. Columbus is going to get there first. They're looking for a pass. They're going to send it behind the net. Columbus trying to backhand it right back in front. Good work by Macon sealing the post. Allowing well, Gavin to get it along the boards over to Gus. Columbus defense steps up. Blocked by Easton was a shot. Leads jumps over to Taylor. Taylor's looking for that pass over to Gus. Just missed. I think that should have been icing, but yep. they didn't call it. Nope. Brady able to get that puck out, send it in front. Nobody's home, though. Uh, good idea, but nobody was there as both of his wingers were right near him. Columbus able to get right back in. Here they go. Columbus looking, stalling, circling, sending a puck in front. Gets blocked by Easton. Good step up by Gavin. Gets it out of the zone. Good work by Brady as Columbus is just trying to wait for everybody to catch up, and they didn't. And so that's an offside. It's been a weird cat and mouse of breakouts. It's uh, not our typical fashion for the Bulls and, and, and Columbus. Normally, it's just a whole bunch of wide open skating. So both D's are clamping down here. Yeah, here goes Columbus, though, when I speak of it. Here we go. Megan. Good save. Oh, no. Wide open there. Megan was trying to cover it. Bulls didn't want to take any chances. So they swiped it off and away from the the middle. Here comes. Uh oh. We got to play her down. That's Remy. Remy. Remy's not one to go down. No, I'm sorry. That's Ethan. That's oh, Ethan, Ethan Gray. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, that injury happened when. Uh, the, the dog pile. Yeah. yeah. Macon was trying to cover, and Bulls recognized the puck was still there. But there's like three players that came in at the same time. All right, he's up. He's up. Looks like he's favoring one leg a little bit. He probably got hit with a stick or something. Or a knee or whatever, but yeah, yeah he's His he's left leg. He's not putting a lot of pressure on it. That hurt. Ethan's tough. Ethan doesn't yeah. stay down long usually. Gavin's out there helping him out. Still not wanting to put much weight on it, so hopefully he'll be all right here. He made it to the bench. So we're going to have a full change in our defensive pairing. Faceoff is going to go wide, far side. Jack is in, along with Will and Ling J. 116 left in the first. Here we go. Columbus gets it back to their D. He's going to wind up, take a shot. It goes wide, high and wide. Comes near side boards. Gavin trying to work it up. He does. They get it out of the zone. Will's chasing. Unable to get it. Columbus sends it right back in. Gavin's going to go out to get that puck, too. Gavin's going to try the other side this time on Ling Jay's side. Puck comes out. A weird bounce again. Allows Ling Jay to get it out. When Ling Jay is just working back and forth along the. Oh, he gets tripped from behind. No call. Ling Jay. I'm down. He's still down. He got up. Now Columbus circling around. Circling. 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 Good save by Megan. Allows a point blank opportunity. Megan makes another great save. Yeah, Columbus still has it. Very much a high stick there right in front of Megan. All right. So that is Nixie. Nixie's going to pass it back to the D. Comes back. Easton's going to get it. He's going to try to send it up. No, it gets stolen there along those far side boards. Now, Puck is just along those boards. Finally sneaks out. Jack's going to try to punch it out. Nope, comes right back in. Ling Jay gets it out, though. Sends it up for Will Dodge just out of his reach. And there's the end of the first period. So, again, a very odd, weird game going yeah. on between Columbus and, and Bulls. Not typical fashion. Normally, it's a lot of skating. A lot of catching Yeah. Players. Both teams seem like they're playing defensively and waiting to set up that breakout. Like, that's what it seems like both teams are doing. Yep. 
I'm trying to see if Ethan was able to come back out. I'm not sure if we've seen him. Yeah, I think I see him down there. That could be Taylor, though. They both have the long, long locks. Yes. <laughs> Luscious hair. <laughs> I see Remy. So hopefully Ethan's okay. All right, John, predictions for the second. I, I don't think we're going to be playing the same cat and mouse game. I think it's going to get a little more wide open. Okay. One, two, three, we may be down a defensive player. I'm still looking for him. So this may cause. Yeah, they have uh, Remy paired with Gavin. So yeah. I think that may cause some issues, too, from a defensive perspective. Of all the weekends for me to leave Elijah's skater gear at home. Huh? Right. <laughs> all right, here we go. All right. Harry's coming out. Take this face off. Reese near side. Finney. And then we also, again, what I just mentioned, Remy is out there with Gavin. So, right now, Bulls are down a defensive player, Ethan. And here we go, real quick. Like I said, wide open. And here we go. Can't give Nixie space. Nope. You Man. cannot give him space. That's what happens right off the bat. Nixie comes out fast and gets the bowls flat footed and sneaks one in. All right, both teams keeping the same lineup up. This time the faceoff comes over to Reese's side. Reese takes it in. Good work by Reese. Trying to send the puck in front for Finney. Columbus gets there first, uses the boards, trying to get it along the near side boards. Harry able to keep it in, sends it deep for Finney. Good work by Reese, sending it right in front. Oh, puck was there for a moment. Harry couldn't find it. Now, here we go, off to the races again. Columbus, this is more like Columbus style. And they send a shot far and wide. Comes this near side, Remy. Oh, another shot goes wide as well. Columbus circling, making us work. Circling the boards, Columbus sends a pass right in front. Blocked away, looks by Harry. Harry's looking up for Finney. Finney's trying to chase it down. Good work by Columbus, separate him, but Finney gets there again, sends a puck right in front. Columbus goalie though, able to break that one up and cover it up. A little more wide open. I think my prediction was was, little, was right here. I think you're right. Yep. 11:48 left in the second. Though I do think the Bulls need to do a little bit more like the first period and not allow it. Good win by Brady over to Easton. Easton takes shot, gets blocked, but rebound opportunity for Taylor. Couldn't find it. Easton keeping it in, stepping up. Easton looking for a backhand. Backhands it in front of the net. No, Columbus gets it. Now Columbus is coming out. Miss just missed a pass. Remy back there. As East is trying to help out, coming back. Good work by Remy getting there, breaking that up. But the puck still comes in front of the net, comes right to East. East sends up a pass. Oh, for Brady. Brady trying to lift the stick, just couldn't get it. Columbus sends it back in, offside. I'm seeing more patience in the passing. I'm seeing they're looking, they're trying to hit their passes in stride. It's, it's been good. working, yeah. Face off one by Brady back to Gavin. Gavin's up there. Good, good lift of the stick by Gus, allowing it to come to Brady. Brady takes shot hard, but high and wide. Taylor along the near side boards, keeping it in. He smushed it along the boards. Now tries to set a pass. Uh, goes over to Brady. Brady wrap around through to Gus. Oh, Gus had Taylor take a shot. It was there. Oh, man, back over to Gus. No. Good defense there by, by Columbus, not allowing that shot to get on net. Good back check by Brady. Sends it right back over to Gus. Gus going to send it in. Columbus gets it, doesn't go deep enough, and they send it, get right back out. That should have been offside. They're not going to allow it. They're not calling it. And now Columbus ends up with it. 
Gets it right out to our defense. East is going to use the boards on the near side. Send a pass up to Gus. Gus has it. He's going, start going wide. Beyond his backhand. He tries a backhand pass. Gets blocked. Columbus gets there first. Columbus is going to... Oh, good poke check by Brady. Getting that one from Nixie. But Columbus gets the puck back. And here they go. This is typical Columbus skating. Good work by Gavin. No, get it out by Nixie. Nixie is going to take a shot. Blocked by Easton. Easton, oh, gets pushed into the yeah, boards. That's a penalty. Cross check. Yep. First penalty of the game. As the Bulls now will be on the power play. With 10 minutes and 7 seconds left. So the faceoff is going to come all the way back into the Columbus side. Let's see who we put out there for the power play. All right. Again, still down uh, Ethan on the defense pair. Normally Ethan comes out there and he's he's winding up his shot. He's on back on the bench. Is he? Good yep. deal. Good he's back deal. On, looks like he's walking. He lonely. is. Good deal. All right. So, but right now, we'll have Remy and Gavin out there on the power play, along with Harry and Reese. Oh, and Harry wins the face. I'll just send a pass in between the defensive pairing. Remy, good job getting it back in with Gavin. Good work by the, the ref keeping the puck in, too. Finney sends a pass right over Reese. Reese backhands it. Oh, almost went in. Here's Harry. Oh, the shot just goes wide into the net. So two good looks here. Reese sends it up for Remy. Remy's going to take a shot. Oh, it gets blocked. Oh, it's still in front. It's still there. It's there. It's a goal. Finnegan in his office waiting for that back door. Harry gets it over to him. And they score on the power play. What about Ooh. that? It's not our usual forte. Usually no. <laughs> we're scored when we're down a man. <laughs> yeah. We like to be shorthanded to score. All right, so 9.34 left in the second. Good work by that power play line. Bulls got to watch the counter punch yep. here. Yep. This we is where Nixie. Nixie likes to score right this here. This is Nixie right here. So, again, here's Columbus coming quick. This is what they do. Speed. They get in the zone. He's looking for the pass. He's looking for Nixie. There's Nixie making a move. Good work by Easton getting that puck away from the middle. Get it over to, to, I think that was Jack. Jack. Yep. Jack tried to send a pass over to Will. No working there. And here goes Columbus. Good blocker. Oh, that's Ethan. Ethan's back out. Good job by Ethan. Putting his stick in the way of the front of that shot. So Ethan and Easton were out there. And it looks like we're going to change back lineups. Get Remy and Ethan back together. All right. Got to be careful here. Columbus wins the puck. They're going to send a shot. Ooh. Macon able to make that save. Puck right in front of the net again. Oh, it's up on top of the net. It rolled up on top of the net. No goal. <laughs> wow. Dangerous right there. We got to be careful here. It popped straight up. Woo. So with nine minutes left in the second, we're going to go ahead and change up our all our entire line here. Registering. The, we still got Nixie out there. Gotta be careful. Brady's one of our better face-off winners here. Let's see what he does. Brady does. He wins it. Far side boards. Nobody home. He goes and gets his own face-off win. However, Columbus gets it. Good work by Easton over here, boarding away. Columbus takes a shot. Wow. Just missed. Here we go. Gavin has it. Send the cross ice pass. No. Intercepted. Good work by Gavin getting it away. Near side, good work between Brady and Taylor getting the puck back. Taylor trying to get over to Brady. He gets it. He's going to take a shot. No, gets get, – oh, it gets hit. Taylor gets hit twice by Brady trying to get the puck in front of the net to Gus. And here we go. This is where Columbus likes. They like space. They like space. Good save by Macon. Blocking that short side as Nixie had it. Now we have a two-on-two. -two. Good pass by Gus. Tipped in by Brady. Columbus gets there first, sends it up the boards. Taylor blocks that one. Taylor makes a few good moves, sends it in front of the net. Nobody home. East is going to try to backhand it in. Good work by Easton, allowing us to stay in Columbus' side. Columbus gets there first, sends it along the boards. Brady takes a spill behind the scene. No call. Columbus in the neutral zone, makes a couple moves, gets in. Good work by Taylor getting the puck back, but Columbus has it. Columbus takes a shot. Wow. You got to be careful. Puck in now. Columbus sends a shot right in on net. Gavin gets it right back to Brady. Brady doesn't have numbers, but you know Brady. He's going to go ahead and wind up taking a shot. Making Worked the goalie. Before. Yeah. 
That's how Ray scored his first goal. That's right. So 7.29 left in the second. Columbus made the save, but the faceoff's now on the Columbus side, far side. Ethan Remy, good to see Ethan back. We got Harry, Reese, Finney. Harry with the faceoff, trying to win it towards Reese. Just gets around Reese. Now here's, again, off to the races, Columbus. This is what they do. Good work by Remy stalling them at the at the blue line, causing that offside. Good work by Remy. Got to slow him down. That's what the first period we did well, slowing down Columbus. It's Columbus' number one strength, speed and space. Don't give it to him. All right, so near side boards. Harry able to get it out just over Finney's stick. Here comes Destin for Columbus into the zone. He's going to backhand a shot, stick to side by Macon. Columbus still has it, tries to send another pass up. Oh, takes a weird hop. Reese tries to get it. Comes over to Ethan. Ethan gets blocked. It's still in the zone. Still in the zone under Harry's skates. Columbus able to find it. They still have it. They're going to wrap around, take a shot that goes wide. They're keeping it in the zone, so Remy's going to have to get the puck. Let's skate it out. He's going to use the boards, try to pass over to Reese. No, blocked in. Again, finally out of the zone. Reese has it along this near side boards. Harry has it now, too. We finally get in the zone. No, we got in offside. Nope. That's a penalty, I believe. That was a penalty? I think. He had his arm up. Yep, they're going to put Destin... In the box for that shoulder oh, on Reese. Destin, Easton's favorite Columbus player. He just couldn't help himself. <laughs> so most of you all know there's a whole lot of history here. Uh, a lot of these Columbus players have played with our team at some point. And so our boys all know each other. Yep. All right. Here we go. Face off. Near side. Finney just over his stick. And Columbus able to get out of the zone. Here they come. Got to be careful. We are on the power play with 6.16 left in the second. We get, we get the puck. Here's Easton. Easton's looking for that pass. Gets it out of the zone. Harry's going to get this puck. Harry's trying to send it up for Finney. A little dump and chase. Columbus gets there first. Oh, just Harry unable to keep that one in. Here comes Columbus right back. So not much going on the power play. More work by Columbus than the Bulls at this point. Columbus giving... Bulls all problems here on the power play. Gavin finally gets it up. Finney tries to use the boards pass himself. Intercepted, though, by Columbus. Columbus sends it right back into the neutral zone. Good work by Harry standing up. I think it was Nixie on yeah. the boards. Here we go. Harry scooting through. He's got Reese. He's got he's got the ability to score. He takes a shot. Oh, big rebound. Reese just couldn't get there. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. Yep. yep. So Reese trying to to get the puck back, keep it in the zone. Just got his stick right around the, the skates and caused the Columbus player to trip. And here we go. So a little wide open. This is not going to be uh, to the strength of the Bulls. This is this is where Columbus shines with space on this ice. And as you see, they're going to put Nixie in, number 11. So with 525, it's going to be four on four for the next 27 seconds. Then Columbus will be on the power play for basically another minute after that. So Bulls got to be careful. You know, there's a lot of space. Good step up by Ling Jay, not allowing that shot on net. Ethan's going to send it along the ice. Columbus selects to keep the puck on the end. Here they are coming back in with 13 seconds left. Nixie's trying to find space. They look opt for a pass. Good block by the Bulls. Getting the puck away. That was Remy. Good work. Here goes Remy. Again, four on four. And now it's a power play for Columbus as their player gets out of the box. Here's Remy. Remy circling. He's got Ling Jay. No, he's looking for the wraparound. Oh, gets hit down by, I think that's Jackson. No call. Ling Jay tries to make a pass over to Brady. Goes right to Columbus. Good back check by Brady getting that puck away. Lifting the stick. So for the next 42 seconds, Columbus is on the power play. And here they go. Got to be careful here. Here they go, taking a shot, Macon! Able to make the glove save, Macon finding the puck. Good save. So 34 seconds left, 428 left. But most importantly, 34 seconds left on the penalty kill for the Bulls.
Looks like we have Harry out there for the faceoff. Finney, Easton, and Gavin. Puck comes near side. They send it back to the blue line. Columbus is going to wind up for a shot. Good block away by Harry. Not allowing it to even get close on net. Finney sends a short one out and into the neutral zone. No icing. Good work by Finney. Now Columbus is going to change sides of the ice. Send the puck in deep. Puck goes. It takes another weird hop off the boards right in front of the net. And making good awareness. Just goes ahead and makes the save there. Covering it up. So four minutes. Seven seconds left in the second. Twelve seconds still. Puck comes near side. They're going to send it back to the to the blue line. They're going to send a shot. Ooh. Just goes wide. I don't, I'm not sure if Megan saw that one. Bulls got to be careful. They send it up. Oh, this is what Finney's known to do. We forgot about shorthanded Finney. Finney. Oh, just couldn't quite get around. Excellent challenge by wow. the goalie. Wow. Wow. Yeah, luckily he's he's stepped up and staying staying in his net. Otherwise, Finney had a great opportunity there. Bulls feeling it. We're at full strength, so the Bulls able to kill off that power play and, and some of that four on four. Puck comes all the way back into the Bulls end. No icing. Gavin has it. Gavin's gonna use the boards. Pass it up to Reese. Reese sends a pass right up to Harry. No, gets intercepted by by Nixie. Nixie looking for it. Reese trying to get the puck away. No, here's Nixie again. Nixie's gonna wind up. Oh, gets blocked by Gavin's stick. So no shot on net there. But again, good work by the Bulls here. Not allowing any shots on net. Making it real tough for the Columbus to set up in the in the slot. Columbus still has the puck in the zone. There's a player down for the Bulls. I think that's Harry. Harry. Puck underneath him. No. Columbus able to finally get it out. Gavin going to retrieve behind the net. Gavin's going to send it right back over to Harry along those boards again. No, here it is in the slot. Oh, we got to be careful here. Backhand opportunity. Oh, it's right in there. Oh, Columbus just missed wide. Bulls got to be ready for this. Bulls again trying to get it out. Columbus applying a ton of pressure. Send it right in front. Blocked away by Easton. Easton is going to backhand this one out. Bulls need a change in line. No, no ability here because we didn't get in deep enough into the Columbus's end. Puck comes back in. Easton's going to get it. Easton changing directions. Sends a backhand pass over to Gus. Gus sends it up for Harry. Harry sends it over to Reese. Just behind Reese. Columbus able to get that puck. We need to, we definitely need to uh, need a change here. Good work by the Bulls defense. Making uh, Nixie take a far shot there and making able to make that save. You see Easton with the love tap right there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's that was for my dad, Angelo. If he's still watching, he's probably in Florida oh, no. somewhere. He's still okay. All right. He's. I thought maybe he's getting his suntan or something right now. All right. Here we go. Jack taking the face off. Comes over to Link J side. Link J. And it looks like Remy's trying to work those boards. Columbus sealed it, so Remy's gonna change direction. Let's try the other boards on Will's side. Nope. Puck comes into the middle here. Easton tries to get it out. Columbus gets it. Remy gets there. Sends it over to Easton. Easton's going to try to backhand it. Nope. Comes back to Easton. Easton's going to make a pass over to, looks like Will. Will's just unable to find it. Now Will's off to the races. Columbus gets it right back into the neutral zone. Good step up by Easton. Anticipating that pass. Allows Jack now. Jack sends a great pass over to Will. Oh, just Will just couldn't find the pass. Here goes Columbus. Jack trying to get it back. Ling J along those boards. Good work by Jack and Ling J. Send it right back in. Will's going to go try to chase. He gets there first. Will, good backhand. Keeping it in deep. Knew he didn't have numbers. Waiting for his team to come. Here's Jack. Jackson makes a pass. Comes all the way back to Gavin. Gavin's going to send a pass all the way back to Jack. Jack, oh, couldn't locate it. Man, he had some space if he found that. Unfortunately, here comes Columbus again. Columbus sends it in just near the net. Macon needs to go ahead and... Okay, they need to... Wow. Can we not cover... Like, we had it kind of covered. He covered it. He covered it with a stick. When the ref loses sight of it, they're supposed to blow the whistle. That should yeah. have been blown dead immediately. Wow. They just let him shove away at a puck. I mean, he stuck his skate yeah. there, and he covered yeah. it with his stick. He yeah. did exactly what he was supposed yeah. to. 
So you're telling me the refs didn't do what they were supposed to do. Yeah. All right, so we got to be careful here. Nixie was trying to finagle his way in. Good work between Brady and Taylor. And here we go. Gus. Oh, Gus. Just lose the stick trying to get it to his forehand. But here's Brady trying to help out. Gus trying to send him a pass. Gus. Oh, Gus. He kicks it over to Brady. Brady scores. Wow. Gus just didn't have much luck at trying to get anything going. But finally, he kicked it over to Brady. My gosh. Brady had a point by shot that goes in. So, with t wow, with only 12.5 seconds left in the second, that was a big goal for the Bulls. Defenders cannot get caught flat-footed no, right no, here. No, 12 seconds is a long time for Nixie. Brady out there. Brady's trying to try to win the faceoff. Nixie, though, gets it. Good work by Gus trying to get the puck away. Gavin realizes, too, gets it right back up for Brady. He's got four seconds. He needs to go ahead and wind up. He does. He scores! Back-to-back -back goals for Brady as time expires in the second period. Wow. Wow. Columbus's goalie's glove is normally on point, but... Different goalie. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. But, man. So, that's, that's Colin Blank. Colin also played with us in 8U. Okay. Um... My apologies. No, it's all good. Um, you're, talk, you're talking about Brogan. That's probably who I'm talking Brogan about. Brogan has uh, probably the best glove in our whole league. Yep. So, wow, Brady scoring two goals in a matter of 30 seconds. I mean, the game was real close. It was 2-1. It's still not far. No, it's not far with the Columbus. Hey, Don't... a three-point three lead ain't a lot for Columbus. I mean, how quick... <laughs> Mixie scored with what, 10 seconds? Yeah. End of the first, end of the second? Yeah. Start of the second. Yep. That's how quick this game can change. And we've seen it before. We were up 3 1 in a game against Columbus. We thought we had it. And Nixie just turned a whole nother speed. And they Coach up. Jeffries is down there telling him, finish the game. We're, yes. we're playing our yes. game. Keep yes. playing our game. Muddy, muddy the speed, water. Like, just don't let them to get that speed. There was right, a so lapse in that second period. Hopefully we come out strong in the third period. And again, don't allow space. Don't allow speed. That is Columbus's game. So the scoreboard is going to be 15 minutes as uh, the mathematicians of Tobin and uh, Brad have figured out there's about two minutes extra to get that full hour. So we're going to play 15 minutes, probably a running clock, I would assume. But let's just stay tuned for that. 4-1. Good work by the Bulls getting it right up to Reese. Reese is going to wrap around and take a shot. And an interesting pairing. Here's Ling J. Ling J is with Harry and Reese. Reese working his way in front. He's going to take a shot. Oh, it goes in. I'm pretty sure Harry scored that. That was Harry, yeah. Wow. Now that's how you start a third period. So with only, uh, yeah, it is a running clock. So we're going to have a running clock for the third period, 14 minutes and 30 seconds. 5-1 bowls. Way to start strong for the third period. All right, we're bringing Brady back out with Gus and Taylor. Brady, clean face-off win, comes all the way back for Gavin. Gavin goes and retrieves, sends a pass right back up for Brady. Oh, just couldn't find his backhand. So Columbus coming right back in. Columbus coming in. Good work by Easton getting that puck away, trying to get it over Brady. Brady's everywhere. Here's Gus trying to work his way back to Brady. Brady just muscling his way out. But Columbus not allowing that puck in. Columbus comes in. Good work by Talon, causing disruption. And now that we break out, we're in the neutral zone. Brady's trying to make a pass. Oh, gets blocked. Good work by Gavin stepping up, backhanding it back over to Brady. Brady's trying to find that third goal of the game, his hat trick. <clears throat> but you got to be careful. Oh, oh, that'll be a penalty on yeah, Brady. Yeah, they don't call that. Yep. And we touch it up as Brady just kind of interfered a little bit with, with uh, Nixie. A little push, a little love tap in the back. And... Uh, this is what we don't need to do right now to give the Columbus space and an extra attacker here. So Bulls are on the penalty kill for the next minute and 30. As, and again, it's a rolling clock, so everybody be mindful of that. So Columbus has the puck near side here. They send it behind the Bulls net. Remy goes and gets it. 
Remy tying up Columbus player. Good work by Remy, tying him up, trying to delay. Good work, Reese is there too. Just trying to keep the puck there. Remy, he's, he's going to keep tying it up. Good work by Remy. And he found that opportunity, he passed it up to Finney. Good work, now Harry's got space. Harry's got a lot of space, but he's got to watch out for Nixie. Nixie's got a whole head of steam trying to back check. He does, he comes all the way back, gets the puck. Here he goes, this is what Nixie likes, a whole bunch of speed. Oh, he missed the puck. Good work, disrupting. And not allowing Nixie to get a whole head of steam through the neutral zone. And the Bulls send it right back. Bulls need to be aware. We are down a player for the next 40 seconds. 12 minutes left in third. And see, this is what we're talking about. We can't give them a whole bunch of space. Here they come. Here comes Columbus winding up a shot. Ooh, hits the crossbar, I think. Finney. This is when Finney likes to do things. This is his time. Oh, Finney makes a move. Finney's going to take a shot. Oh! Wow, nice wow. stop. Finney, nice stop. Finney, you know this. Short-handed, it's when Finney shines. All right, so 5-1, nine seconds left on the power play for the Columbus Cotton Mouse. It's like it'll expire it'll probably before expire. they the puck. Yeah, this is odd, but it will. Um, yeah, go ahead and let them out. It was a good, good delay tactic by the Bulls changing lines here at the last second. I'm supposed to tell you Diane's also watching. Oh, Oh, she actually decided to watch. Okay. All right. Hi, Mom. All right. Easton's out there, Mom. He's far side. Oh, good step up there. Wheel couldn't find it. Here goes Columbus. Skating five aside as the Bulls now. Good work by Easton. Mom, I did not teach him how to do that. Was excellent. That's all sides. <laughs> and then he gets pushed wow. down there at the end. No Easton call. was like, you're not skating by me. Nope. Not today. All right, so we're keeping Jack out there with Ling J and Will. Will's on the far side. Jack wins the face off to Ling J's side. Cottonmouth's able to keep this one in. Easton's trying to step up to get this puck out. Disrupting is Easton. Good work. He gets it to the midline. Here comes Ling J. We have three on two. Ling J. Ling J needs to wind up. Oh, he takes a shot high. Man, he felt that one. All right, Will's alongside boards. He gets muscled away from the puck from three Columbus players. And again, can't give them speed. Here we go. Good work by Easton again. Stepping up. Making another play on the Columbus player. Not allowing them to get into that zone far. Gets right back to Lee J. Lee J. Lee J. Oh, the puck's in the air. Jack takes a shot. It goes just wide. Oh, my goodness. Easton along the far side. He's going to go ahead and keep it in. Dump it in deep. Will tries to make a sneaky pass. Backhand pass. Jack tries to. Oh, that's a elbow. That's a, that's a penalty, but no call. The ref was there. Thought it was legal, so here comes Columbus. Look at Jet. Oh, Will! What great back check by Will there. Felt like he needed to play for his boys after they got hit there behind the scenes. Oh, Columbus still has it, though. Got to be careful. Columbus making a couple moves. Sends a puck in front of the net. Good work by Easton getting it out. Gavin able to try to get it out of the zone. No, Columbus keeps it in. Takes a shot. Good block by Gavin. Not allowing it on net. Gavin takes a puck. If we race, like Will does. Look at Will. Oh, Oh, Will had him beat, but Columbus, I think, just lifted his stick just enough to get him disrupted. Here comes Columbus. That's Nixie. Nixie's going to take a shot. Good save by Macon, and he just goes down and covers that one up. Gavin saying, no, not today, Nixie, not today. So running clock, less than nine minutes left in the third. Bulls are still winning 5-1. We're going to go ahead and bring Brady out against Nixie. Brady's been having a, a good percentage face-off win here. Again, he wins the face-off. Columbus gets there first. Finney, though, sends it up. Interesting pair. We're putting Finney out there with Brady. Changing up Ling J. Puck comes over to Talon's side. Talon's got some space. He's going to take a shot that goes wide. Almost a deflection opportunity from the backboards was Brady. Is Finney playing defense? Yeah, he is yeah. playing D. Oh, that, that went goes in. in! Wow! Gus went wow. over the head. Wow! How did he get that wow. shot in? The flamingo. Did you see that? That was such a bad angle shot. Wow! He it's hit like top it, post. It's like it went just over the goalie's shoulder. Wow! I, I don't even know how he snuck that one in. That was wild. Wow! What an amazing shot! I hope his dad's watching. I heard he's out of town. Otherwise. Gus, you missed out on that one. 
All right, here we go. We're going to keep that same line out. Oh, Brady wins it. Yeah, Fenny is playing D. He's, I, I wonder if uh, we need to check up on uh, Ethan. Ethan's out. So Ethan's out, and that's what's happening. So we're going to go ahead and put Finney on D for the time being. That was, nope, not offside. Not offside. Here comes the Cotton Mouse. Cotton Mouse. Cotton Mouse. Good stick to side by Macon. Good stick to side again. Bulls playing good D. Not allowing good shots on that. Oh. Penalty. On the Bulls. Got a hook on somebody. Looks like Taylor. Taylor. Yeah. So Bulls up 6-1. After that incredible shot by Gus. Again, reminder, it's a rolling clock, so these penalties are going to come in and out real quick. So just less than seven minutes left in third. But what spectacular play. I mean, our boys have come to play this morning. They are so. not allowing a lot of time and space. My biggest fear are are these penalty power plays. Right. As, I mean, look, they're, they're putting Nixie now back on the blue line. Look, that's, uh, that's Dylan taking a shot. Making able to make the save. In my mind, that's a oh, big... See? Yep. Switching sides. They're yep. putting Jackson over here now. Watching what Columbus is up to. Because <clears throat> they're going to try to wind up some shots from the blue line. Gavin sends it along the boards to Easton side. Reese is going to be there to try to help out. Columbus, though, gets there first. They're going to send a pass. They're using behind the net. Here they go. Wrap around. Right in front. Point blank. Oh, backhand goes high and wide. I think that was Dylan that took that shot. Gavin tries to backhand it out. Columbus loses their edge, though. Able to make the pass. Macon's going to go ahead and cover that one up. Good work by Macon. Slowing this down. As Columbus is circling. With five, just under five minutes and 45 seconds left. 37 seconds left on the penalty kill. The longer Columbus takes to set up, the more likely this penalty kill is going to be over. we got to be careful here. I'm not sure what Columbus is doing. They had too many players on the ice. They skated over somebody late. Puck was dropped, though. Puck comes far side to Easton. Easton gets it. Looking for a pass. He's going to use space. Good work by Easton. Get it over to Harry. Harry goes and gets it. Harry, not quite deep enough. We need to just send it in deep. We're still down a player. Send it in deep. Be patient. Here goes Harry. Look at him working hard. He gets it back. He took on the whole team. And he's got the puck, and he's killed the power play. So we are at full strength with, with five minutes left in the third. Here goes Reese. Reese. Reese using the boards. Gets over to Harry. Harry's looking for a pass to Ling J. No, gets blocked. Columbus tries to send it up. They do. They get it out. Oh, gets pushed. Behind, that was Easton trying to keep it in. He just couldn't. Here goes Harry trying to smush it through. Harry, I swear, if there was a wall there, Harry would still try to get through that thing. <laughs> he probably would make it through. And he finally gets it to Ling J. Ling J's going one up for a shot. Oh, big rebound. Reese couldn't get there. Puck comes out. Near side boards. No, not hard enough. Easton able to step up. Keep it in for the time being. No, he gets it out now. Easton's going to backhand it to his defensive partner. Good work. Keeping space and time. Gavin trying to make a pass over to Reese. Just couldn't, but the puck, good work by e. him keeping it in by Gavin. Gavin takes a shot. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Link J, another shot that just goes high. Reese tries to send it back to Easton. Easton keeps it in. Good work getting it back to Reese. Reese trying to give it over to Jack. Puck takes a weird bounce off the boards. Jack trying to keep it in. No. And now we got speed. Here it is. Let's see if Easton can catch it. No. Here's this other. Oh, make it with the point blank save. Wow. And now we got a penalty. And here we go. As I think Gavin probably took a little exception to the the wax at it as Macon was trying to make the save. Hey, Macon got up and fought for himself too, so. I'm telling you, you that's, that's how Columbus has typically beaten us. The speed, yep. space, we kind of got a little bit undisciplined there, and that's when this – but great job by making to Make. come in clutch right wow. there with that stop. That's right. Again, got to be careful here. Three minutes left in the third period. Bulls doing an excellent job. Just a couple mistakes where we let Columbus play their game. But otherwise, this has been a Bulls-like game. Here we go. This is, looks like it's Gus. No, that's Will. Will with Brady. That's why I'm so – oh, Brady. Brady trying to wind up for that. Oh, get over to Will. Will backhands it just wide. 
Oh, man, Will almost had one. So 244 left in the third. Good work by Brady, keeping it in to Jack. A lot of odd pairings going on. Brady able to keep it in? No, they're going to call that one offside. Yeah. So Bulls having to change lineups a little bit. Ethan's completely out, so we're missing a defensive player. Uh, he tried to come back in. It looks like I guess he was unable to play the rest. Hopefully he's okay. Um, we, you know, maybe he plays in the next game. Maybe he doesn't. Um, these are just friendlies. As you can see here, Finney's playing D with Remy. Here we go. Don't give him too much space. Here they go. That's what they do. They like space so they can get their speed. Good work by Ling Jay helping out. Ling Jay has the puck. He's got time. They're giving him tons of space. He goes ahead and sends it up to Talon, who makes a pass over to Gus. Columbus defense gets the puck away. Here's Ling Jay. Ling Jay working that board. Ling Jay is just, I mean, he's big. He's using it too. He just bulldozed that whole wow. board. Uh, go stick by Remy poke checking that one away. Man, the Bulls, every player back checking, making the defensive life so easy. Finney back there playing D. Normally he's playing wing, but Finney, he's our captain, and he can play pretty much any position. I haven't seen him play goalie. But he probably could do it, right? And he's such an athlete, he probably yep. could for sure. All right, Remy stepping up, getting the puck out. We're in the neutral zone. A lot of neutral zone play right now. Talon smushed up along the boards by Columbus with a minute left in the third. Bulls look like they're going to be able to pull this victory off with a 6-1 lead. We don't want to hold – we don't want to play on their heels, though. We don't want Columbus to have any hope going into that second game that we allowed them to score another goal. Puck along the near side boards. Able to keep it in under the Bulls. Columbus sends it along the boards again. Columbus in the neutral zone. Good work by Remy getting the puck away. Here's Talon. We got 35 seconds left. Talon's going to dump it in. I mean, what a great game by the Bulls here. Just not allowing Columbus. This is where they would typically break out. Good work by the D. Good work by Ling Jay. Gus laying out Mixie right in the center ice. I think it was an accidental run into. Wow. Really patient on these passes, like you said earlier. Lig J trying to get that pass. Columbus just trying to get it out of their own end. They do. Finney's just going to hold on to it. Two seconds left, and this is it. Bulls pull off an impressive win. 6-1 for the Bulls. All around, great game. I mean, no real fast break chances for Columbus. Just two. We played the Bulls-like game there. That's it right there. So hopefully we can do that again. Second game. Yep. 345. We'll be Play back. Play like that. Yeah. Thanks for watching, y'all. All right. Go Bulls. Go Bulls.